there is a combination in Shining Time Station of nurturing, uh, freedom, uh, lesson learning, uh, chaos, and, and, and we were trying, she was talking about these things, but I pointed out that, that Mr. Conductor, one of the fascinating, she says, why is he the most fascinating? Why is it, just, not just because he's 18 years old, what is it about? My own feeling of things is that in the womb, we're in the oceanic state, and we are completely part of nature. We are attached to nature. Physically, everything comes through tubes and all that kind of shit and everything, and you don't have to do a goddamn thing, and you are at one, and you're in union, and everything's cool. And then you get torn out of this fucking thing, and all this violence happens, and uh, including the slapping and the acid wash and all of those things, but this room, and now you're out of there and you're individuated and the individuation starts. You are Johnny Phillips and you are going to be a lawyer and you're going to be just like your father and you got red hair and you're going to have a temper and all of this shit is true of you and this is true of you and that's true and you better shape up and you better have a goal and you better do this and you better do that. And the union is over and the rest of the life is spent yearning for reunion and, and to join the one again. And that's where religion perverts that longing. Religion perverts that natural longing in people which more primitive people have found a way of having for themselves a communion with nature and a balance and a harmony with nature. Not I am distant from nature and separate and I will change the course of that river and I will I will farm and I will, I will make freaks out of these animals and keep them, you know, and, and take milk out of them and all that. Not to control nature, but to live in harmony with and, and blah, 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 okay? So we have this loss and this loss of union. I don't feel safe on this planet. I feel very comfortable in the universe. I feel very safe in the universe. I identify more with carbon atoms than I do with my fellow species members <laughs> because they are perverted. They have perverted wonderful things. Uh -huh. the, the, this, this machine, this brain that, that evolved, capable of so much, has been perverted in the interest of, 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 of power and property. And how can this be? This is mine. The first thing we do in land here, this is mine. You look, get your own. This is mine. The first impulse should be, <clears throat> we land on the earth. Has everybody got some meat? Is everybody okay? Everybody's okay? Good. Let's get out of the water and play. But no, it's like, this is my rock. It wasn't rock. It's not yours. I had it. I saw it first. It's my rock. You know? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, okay, back to Mr. Conductor. What I pointed out to her was, he's, he's got these two things combined. He's small, like a child, and he's childlike like a child but he's fully developed physically like an adult and he's wise like an adult and these things are joined and there's a unity in him that is complete so anyway those are just some ruminations no i think so. that's wonderful stuff keeps I mean, me it's, keeps it's, me it's, safe it's, keeps uh, me happy it's got it's my yeah. spiritual connection it's the only one i need I and i and i do pray the way I feel about it is when I'm really troubled by something that I feel the need to utter a, oh, would you, you know, please, or, hey, make sure that, you know, those kind of sentences. <laughs> what, I, what I feel I am doing, I really don't believe I'm saying it to an entity, but I think what I'm talking to is the part of myself that is larger than myself and that is outside of me, the part of me that is not in here, but that I know exists everywhere else out there in some way. And so, by speaking to my larger self, by saying, listen, man, this person is really too much. I can't take this off me. Please just take this off me. I'm, giving, I'm turning this person over to you. This person is now yours. I'm going to start acting differently about it. You take care of that. It's not my responsibility. Don't let me bother with it anymore. You know, that kind of thing. I, I really don't feel that there's a God saying, okay, George, I feel that I have sort of told another part of me who can do something about it to do it you know don't be sitting around here you limited fuck you have an unlimited part out there talk to him just transfer transferring to you cool